Hello everybody, and welcome back to Stay Out of the House. Um, so we're gonna, go, we're gonna jump straight back into this. Last time, uh, you know, we got trapped, but that's okay, that's okay, you know. We can, we can get out, we can get out, we can do this. We're gonna find that dog, though. I'm taking that dog with us one way or another. What did this thing do again? Wasn't this like a light meter, or like, lightnometer? Oh, that's right, we got one tape, if we need to save again. Oh god, that's a lot of reading. Okay, chapter one, the bare necessities. They say to escape the unexpected for many reasons. Any, They say to expect the unexpected for many reasons. Any person's individual circumstances will always further determine what one might need when faced with danger. Within this chapter, we will discuss the necessary means of having or obtaining goods such as food or water, as well as medical tools and treatments in the event of any emergency. It is most important to have at least one of these two things. We've separated two. We've separated the two in the categories to undergo further explanation. One, water. Two, medical tools and treatment. One, food and water. It is important to stay hydrated whenever possible. Otherwise, dehydration can lead to mild or major bodily complications, such as fatigue, dizziness, confusion, or extreme thirst. Having something to eat on your person at all times is just as necessary. You never know in what circumstances you might need it. Non-perishable and high-protein foods items such as nuts, granola bars, and canned soups or chilies are great examples that can be used in is any need needed situation. Making sure you're hydrated and well-nourished will allow you to regain strength, stamina, and awareness, which could all be key factors toward saving your life during an emergency. Medical tools and treatments. If you find yourself injured, whether it be from gash in the skin or sprained ligament, it's always important to have bandages and or medicines. Without the proper equipment, it will be much more difficult to recover from your injuries. Some examples of different types of bandages that are good to have on your persons are conforming bandages, self-adhesive bandages, and elastic bandages. Each are used to perform treatment for different types of wounds, which we will explain about in Chapter 11. Some examples of medicine necessary are pain relievers, such as whatever that word is, or aspirin, as well as sanitizers, ointments, saline solutions, and more. We'll also be discovered further in Chapter 11. God, why did I read that whole thing just as we started? My throat was not ready for that. <clears throat> okay, so am I going to need food? Cause I don't have any. All right, back out we go. Where's my lighter? Here's my lighter. Okay, we can't do none of that fan cause it's on. Okay, that's right. There were two drop points in the vent, I believe. Sorry about that, guys. I was trying to figure out what that background noise was, but I think it's the game. He's killing whatever that is. We've already read that. Okay, so we can climb up that in emergency. Good to know. Of course it's locked. Why wouldn't it be? Oh, the lamp is made out of flesh! I didn't even notice that! <laughs> So 
Well, that's not the drop down we need, evidently. It's not down there. Is that a camera? Oh, they, they do not have cameras. Oh, if they have camera guys, we might be fucked. Okay, that one's locked. My stuff, no touch. I fucked up! I fucked up! I fucked up! Oh god! <gasps> he has a key! No way I have to get that from him! a key. Oh, this is so bad. Okay, we're gonna explore some before we even try to do that. Okay, so that doorknob is unbreakable. Okay, so there is a camera upstairs. Speaking of camera film, Peace has found one of three. Is that a nuclear symbol? Oh, I have to turn power on? Oh, this is gonna be fun. Trying to listen out for him. Yeah, I'm gonna let the camera see us, and then we're gonna go hide again. We're gonna see if we can't get the key from him. Should be coming. He came last time. Come on, buddy. Don't got all day here. He's not coming this time.
Yes, another save. Okay, okay. Bandages. I can't get items. What? Cabinet door is locked. Okay, we're gonna have to make some sacrifices here. Mm. Oh! This is something different! We found Grandma! I'm not gonna mess with Grandma. I'm gonna leave Grandma alone for right now. Last time, Grandma... Grandma did not do good for me last time. It's too complicated to pick. That's lovely. <gasps> this is perfect. This is perfect. <gasps> oh. I hear him. Get out of here, rat. Maybe I was crazy earlier and he didn't have a key. I could have swore there was something sparkling on him. I'll have to go back and watch later on and see. Where was that thing? He obviously knows I'm not here anymore. I'm gonna go play this tape and see what it is so we can get it out of our inventory. Oh, he's not there chopping anymore. That's right. Ugh. Hear me out. I could take this screwdriver. Screwdriver. I don't know what I just said. We go to the mom and we just jam it in her neck. Just ah. Okay, which tape is the one we need? Save my story. This one. What? Hold on a minute. No, 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 wait. CVU tape three. Oh, okay, so they're really just... Okay, well. Alright, well, since that's what that does, I'm gonna drop this tape up here. That way I know it's here. And keep this save on me in case we find another safe room kind of area.
Okay, that's the wrong way. That's locked. Shows a crowd draining a man's blood. That's lovely. I can't believe that worked. a paper clip. Okay, so that's a difficult lock. Great. My thing's up. Oh, hey, buddy. Okay, so we've got a hammer now. I didn't see a key on him, like before. This is just a closet. If I can hit him with this or not, or how this is gonna work. I hear him again. So, for those of you wondering how I know when he's getting close, my controller does this vibrating thing, like his footsteps. That's why I'm trying to use that to gauge when he's nearby. What is happening?
I know I'm making noise. I'm trying to be careful. I don't want him to catch me off guard. Okay, I don't hear him. We've got a gun. He's dead, obviously. Okay. Oh, God, what I want to drop, though. Okay, that can be used to defend myself. Drop them. I don't think I have any bullets, though. I'm so glad I did. Drop the hammer. Where am I? Benedict's revolver and automatic pistol. Join millions of other Benedict's gun owners in defending yourself the right way. The new Lockwood revolver has a double action design. It comes in 44 caliber with an 8 inch nicked plated barrel. Blackstone front. Blackstone, black, blackstone front sights and the smooth walnut grip. Never fired a gun before? It's no problem with Benedict. Simply press X to stop and examine the gun and slide out the cylinder. Then place a new bullet in each of the six holes. Sliders in back, slider it, slider it in back, and you're ready. Sorry, God. it's hard to read that because it's like it, it's moving the thingy. And you're ready to go. Remember, you have six shots, so make them count. I imagine I don't have any bullets in you. I have no bullets. Oh, that is unfortunate. Ah, oh, they've been dead a while. My controller's doing that beep uh, thingy. Surely he can't get me down here.
So I think we're in the basement. I think this is the door that was in the basement. Oh, yep, there he is. Hey, buddy! God, if I only had a bullet, I'd shoot you from here. I don't think I can kill him. I don't imagine, like, that's something I can do. Oh, hello. Drain cleaner? More bandages. How do I use my paper clips? What's happening to me? The throbbing is driving me crazy. Sorry if I skipped over that first part, guys. So I'm having headaches? Oh god, am I turning into a little monster? So what I'm going to do, I'm going to drop all my stuff in the save room. And we're going to go back, get all those items, and bring them here. Leave me alone, buddy. Nobody's here. Is he gone? Give him another minute, just to be sure. Don't tell me you're chilling up here right now. Footsteps still sound pretty close.
Maybe I can smash the lock with a hammer. Didn't mean to do that. Let's go save. We've got a lot of items built up on our save room and we've made some pretty decent progress. So I think that's worth a save. Remember how to get to the save room. Back this way. I think it was. I think it was over here. Yeah, because there's the fan. Okay, so the save room should be right here. Okay, so we've got drain cleaner. A battery and some bandages. That's great. I'm going to try to save tapes only for when we make like a lot of good progress. And I think we made some good progress here. Okay, that's all we really need for right now. I'm going to go downstairs. I'm going to try to open those wood boards if I can't smash through them. Making sure I can quick select, because I'm probably going to have to shoot him in the head. I doubt one bullet's going to stop him, but we're going to try. I can't remember how to get out of here. Oh, he's back to cutting. He's back to cutting. Okay. I don't know why he got up. Just go back downstairs, buddy. Oh, hi! I'm dead. Two days? Oh, no, you're...
you're crazy. I'm reloading my save. Oh, he's watching me. Hey, right, we need to be a lot more careful. Note to self. <laughs> he also does not take many hits to KO us. There's an emergency gas system? Oh, hell no. So he can gas me out the vents. Yeah, I hear him coming. Yep, no, that's a rat. I thought I heard him walking. No, oh, there he is. Okay, I knew I heard footsteps off in the distance. Rat, you are invading my space here, dude. still hear you man I'm not leaving this bed until I know until I hear those footsteps go away dude that's how he got me before he came to the closet I don't think he knew about those but I guess it is his house so hear him, but I don't know where.
No, you just wait, you old woman. I'm gonna do it again. I'm gonna load my save. I'm gonna kill you, and I'm gonna shoot him as soon as he comes to that door. I'm glad to know that we can get rid of her like that. I got an achievement, I'm trying to see what that was. I think it was like kill grand not grandma or something. I'm if I stare at this. What is happening right now? Oh! I, I just pass out! And I got an achievement for it. Stare at a TV for too long. Sacrifice! Oh, I'm being carried by him. Achievement unlocked sacrifice. Run out of time. Well, I... I well, alright then. Alright guys, so that's the sacrifice ending, I guess, and I guess we'll end the episode there. We are going to keep going. We're going to beat this game. I will do all endings if I have to, but that's one of them. Note to self, don't look at TVs, and I can bash Grandma's head off, which we are going to do next episode. I, I, if, if Grandma hadn't have been there at the beginning, I could have gone down those stairs. I could have been with my best boy dog, alright? She, she sabotaged me. And I feel like this is all Grandma's fault anyway. But thank you guys all so much for watching this episode of Stay Out of the House. If you liked it, hit that like and subscribe button, guys. Consider giving me a follow on the channel. Stay tuned for more. And if you're new to the channel, welcome. There's a lot of series on the channels that I think you guys will really like. So go back and watch those. Check them out and have fun. And as always, I will see all of you in the next adventure. See you around, everybody.